we're going to think about multiplication in year four. And we're going to think about multiplying two and three digit numbers by a single digit number. So first of all, a two digit number. So we'll have 56 multiplied by six. And we're going to use grid method multiplication. So I'm going to make myself a grid like this and put my multiplication sign in the corner there. Now at the top here, I'm going to partition this number into its tens and units. So we have five tens or 50 and six units. So five tens, six units makes 56. And I'm going to put this number down here. So now I'm going to multiply this, num this number by this number. So 50 multiplied by 6 is 300. Now I'm going to multiply this number by this number. So 6 multiplied by 6 is 36. Now I have to add these two numbers together. So I have 300 plus 36. So my answer is 6, and then a 3, and a 3. So my answer is 336. I'm going to put that up here to complete my sum. So 56 multiplied by 6 equals 336. So now if we have a look at multiplying a three-digit number. So 136 multiplied by 5. So as before, I'm going to start by drawing my grid. And I'm going to put my multiplication sign here. Now this time, I'll have to partition my number into hundreds, tens and units. So this number is 100 and 36. And I'm going to multiply by 5. So 100 multiplied by 5 is 500. 30 multiplied by 5 is 150. And 6 multiplied by 5 is 30. So as before, I have to add my numbers together. So I've got 500. 150 and 30. So this is my answer. An 8 and a 6. 680. So 136 multiplied by 5 is 680.